Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading My In-Laws Are Obsessed With Me, episode 47 to 48. Whew, let's go ahead and get started. You know, about Lady is Letty? Do you think she's his grace child? What? I mean, the whole family's been here in the capital ever since she arrived. Maybe they want to name her the heir. But, but what about young Master Sylphius? Who's to say? Oh, poor kid. Perhaps that's why her grace is leaving. You said she might be leaving, didn't you? I I'm not sure about that. Besides, I've only just come here, so I could be wrong, though. I only overheard it by chance. Besides, the young master left to talk with Sir Moulton afterwards. But you said that the young master's face turned pale. He truly adores her grace, you know. He even told me before that. Enough! We're in the residence! I should never have told you that. But I like her grace. And she seems rather close with Lady Shersha, too. So what? She's going to leave anyways. For her sake, I think divorce would be the best. There's young Master Selfius and now Lady Esleti, too. Even if she does have children, it's unlikely they'll be named heir. Oh, my. My lord. Ooh, they're in trouble, trouble. My in-laws are obsessed with me. Episode 47. So that's what he heard. Could you please tell me what happened? I don't want you to leave. But... I'm afraid what they said about you might hurt your feelings. <laughs> Selfie. I know what they said made you upset. <sighs> so that's what you said. How could you? Normally, we're up to our ears in work with a sudden increase in guests. It's hard to staff up on short notice. It was Her Grace herself who, or who organized our annual leave system and improved our working conditions. But she said she wouldn't intervene in the hiring process and left it entirely up to us. And after all that, you go and talk behind her back? How dare you? Especially you, you foolish girl. How many times did I warn you? I, I, I'm sorry. So what happens to us now? No way. I did not. I did not expect that. This matter is beyond me now. P please. This, w this won't go unpunished, I assure you. Okay, so they did not. It's just a warning. That is gruesome. Selfie didn't tell me anything in the end. He always been like that. It's as if holding it in is habitual. What's wrong? Is something bothering you? It's fine, uncle. There's a boy. I think something is troubling him, but he won't tell me anything. 
I don't know what to do. A boy. Well, this sounds familiar somehow. Oh, your father said the same thing. You used to be like that too. Uh, what? When? Your father asked the same question about you. Really, you're growing to resemble him by the day and not just with your looks. <laughs> Why is my head so big, brother? Oh, why is, why is my head so big, brother? Not this rate. I'll never find anyone to marry. Oh, come on. It's because of our light-colored hair. It's all just an illusion. Yeah, same here. Don't cry, dear brother. I'm sure you'll meet a nice lady someday. <laughs> brother Perishati. I have a mirror too, you know. <laughs> I really miss your father, especially on days like today. Perhaps I should have a chat with his servants later. You'll take the items for auction today, won't you? Yes. Maybe I should go to the academy to see him. Or would that look like I'm stepping out of line? Even so. Wow, that's the end? Oh, this is a weird word. Death penal? I guess it's not a word because I can't find it on Google and so I'm sorry guys. I'm gonna say Def Def Penil Academy. I feel I thought it was a word. Oh, we weren't expecting you, Your Grace. It's getting hotter by the day. Uh, how is Selfius doing? Is he well? Why yes, he is. Actually, I thought he might fall behind the other students who have been studying in the capital, but I needn't have it. I needn't needn't have worried. He works hard and he's keeping up with our curriculum just fine. His test results are great too. Would you like to take a look? One thing though. Other students find it hard to get get along with him. He didn't grow up in the capital after all. And this is his, this is his classroom. Class is in session right now, so. Uh. He sure is studying hard. <laughs> Would you like to see him now? It's fine. If you don't mind me asking. My husband enjoys collecting items from the Lebrons, and I hear the head of the guild is rather occupied with a fundraising party. Uh, your grace is hosting the party, are you not? Oh, uh, yes, I am. If I may, would it be all right for me to attend the party with my husband and child? Ooh, ooh, <laughs> I don't know. In today's society, or in my culture, if you're not invited by the host, it's kind of weird to even ask the host, like, well, can I come? But, I mean, uh, of course, I shall send you an invitation. Really? Oh, it is such an honor to be invited to a party held in the Grand Duke's Manor. I also hear a number of foreign items will be sold at the auction. Such items are rare, you see. I'll think it'll be a good experience for my child, too. Oh, a good experience, you say? It'll be a good experience for Selfie as well. If fortune allows, he may be able to befriend other young nobles. Hmm? Oh. 
Why are you out here? It's class time. Are you skipping again? I only came out to go to the bathroom. But this is the opposite direction. Anyway, extend your greetings to Her Grace, the Grand Duchess. The Grand Duchess? Your good grades won't forgive everything you do, child. Now go back to class. Sure, sure. That boy is rather unique. Zelfius never skips class, unlike that boy. He got caught skipping class again. Where? Oh. My in-laws are obsessed with me. Episode 48 About the maids, my apologies. As their manager, I should have kept a more watchful eye on this matter. I shall let every last one of them go. Don't bother. The Grand Duchess has already decided to what to do with them. Pardon? She asked me to let her handle it. B -b please excuse me. Two to be sent to the stables and another... Wait, is this... It is. It is the residence in the countryside where Selfie used to stay. But wouldn't it be better to fire them so they won't work again? I believe so too. But the Grand Duchess thought otherwise. She wants to use those maids for selfie. Pardon? Your grace. The school ends early today. Yes, it, it did. <laughs> A few hours earlier. Your grace. Selfies. What about class? His teacher was considerate enough to send him home early. And how are the preparations for the fundraiser party going? Have you decided who to invite? Yes, I am almost done with the list. Well, I wish to invite some acquaintances of mine. It would be my pleasure. Tomorrow, I'm going to look through some of the items from the LeBrons with Lady Shersha, and I'd like to look over the items from the Count Countdom with Selfie. Oh. Selfie, would you like to come to the party too? Your teacher said she will come with her child. Sorry? Yes, that's a splendid idea. You are the successor, after all, and there will be more events like this in the future. We should have you have involved you more in these things, but the leaders of the house haven't really been socially active this thus far. Oh, okay. The tailor is scheduled to arrive soon. Perhaps we could ask him to make an outfit for the young master as well. Hmm? What'd you say, Selfie? I'm like that. Then have it done. Yes, Your Grace. Mm, looks so handsome. Wow. <laughs> the pink one. I like the pink one. <laughs> okay. Easy reads, right? It's all about connecting with Selfius. And it's sad that, you know, of course, gossiping maids are the worst, but it needed to happen here because this is the only way for them to kind of unlock Selfius' like behavior. He's very to himself. He's very, um, he's an introvert. And I guess his whole life he has always been like that, where he he didn't have a freedom to express himself without any sort of, you know, repercussion. So it's nice that Parashati is here to be his friend and 
help him. But it's also sad because he knows sooner or later she's going to be gone. And every day it seems like everyone's just like rooting for her to stay. But we shall see. All right, guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and reacted to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!